There's like a million and one boxes. Guys, I finally got it. Look how freaking humongous it is. Can fall okay, I'm gonna try it anyways. I did have one fail though. We're gonna go to Sephora and get some samples. We've been literally planning on seeing bad moms for so long now. Hey guys, happy Vlogmas Day 14. I'm starting off the day by unboxing some Amazon Studio lights. Ryan actually got this for an early Christmas gift. So thanks babe. I'm excited to um, set it up, but it, it seems like it's gonna take a while. I don't know. I just like I'm not good at setting up things There's like a million and one boxes. Those are all light bulbs though So that shouldn't be that bad, but like I don't really know how to do all that. Oh, this is what I was looking for a manual So I'm gonna go ahead and link these lights down in the description box if you guys are interested in them or want to buy them I think they were around a hundred dollars, but they look like some heavy duty shit, y'all. Like I'm actually kind of worried because I did think that they would be easier to like put back away and like store away because you know, when I go back to college, I don't have that much room to like just have my lights sitting out in my beauty room because I don't have a beauty room at college. So these lights are box lights. I used to have umbrella lights and I don't know, I'm just kind of like over them. I wanted to, you know, upgrade my lighting a little bit. And it's nice because they come with all these like light bulbs, so I didn't have to go out and buy them myself. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Guys, I maybe didn't really research this well enough, but this is actually really cool. Very like professional. So this is like the box part. And it opens up like that. But first, I think we have to put it on this thing. Shit around me. I literally cut myself. How did that even happen? What the heck? Guys, I finally got it after a really long time of trying to figure out these little like wires that go into it. Yeah, that was a struggle. So it has five lights, and I'm gonna place the first one in. How exciting. So the last step is to put on like the soft box part. Oh, it has like Velcro. Okay, now I'm gonna try to plug it in and see what it looks like. This part is actually really nice because then I don't have to stare into something super duper bright and hopefully it doesn't get me as hot because usually when I film like I get so hot. This is really cool because you can turn like some off and like make it a little dimmer or have them all on at the same time. I don't really know what this is. I'm so proud of myself. Look at that. So if you saw my vlog from a little while ago, you saw me and my dad like putting up my Christmas tree and like putting on the ornaments on it and stuff. But guess what? After we did all that, <laughs> we found out that the lights weren't working and like now we know, my mom told us. She was just like, you, you're you supposed to always like check the lights before you put the ornaments on. You know, we didn't know, we're dumb. So <laughs> that one is currently somewhere in there, like in a living room in there, but this is a new one. Look how freaking humongous it is. I've never had a big Christmas tree like this. It's freaking huge guys. Like. That's a big Christmas tree and I'm really pumped about it. But Ryan's been helping my dad um, like put that up and just like some other stuff like move around some furniture and stuff because my dad's having a party on Saturday. So he just wanted some things to be moved around and now he's done. So I wanna go to like CVS or something like that, Walgreens, I don't care, just to get some makeup products because I wanna do like, um, like a five step makeup routine or something like that, like super easy for young girls or girls who are just starting to get into makeup. Ryan's cousin actually wanted me to do this video, so I'm excited to do it. Hopefully it turns out good because you know me, if I do my makeup, I don't really go for the simple look, but I am kind of excited to go to the drugstore and see what makeup I can get because I do want a powder foundation because I don't have one of those or like, I know there's like the Lumi cushion. I've heard that one was really good, I think but I don't know, I just want like something quick and easy to put on the face 
And then I do want to get another blush too. I think you can just be unsmelly by putting a white robe on. I've literally been wearing this outfit for like five days straight. Literally, look at it, she looks smelly. That is just the reality of life, y'all. She just looks gross, doesn't she? <laughs> You're mean. So like I said, Ryan's coming or wanted me to do a video about like drugstore, like cheap or just like beginner makeup. Um, so I got the um, L'Oreal Lumi Cushion Foundation. I don't know which one, which color I am. Obviously this looks white, but like, I don't know. So I'm just gonna get both and test them out and then return whatever. Oh my god, why am I dropping everything? I also wanted to try out this one. It's the e.l.f. blush palette in dark. It's only $4, which, you know, it's pretty expensive for e.l.f. <laughs> but it's okay. And then I also got some castor oil. Hmm? It's expensive? Like, it is expensive? Yeah, for it's elf? expensive. $4? It's, yeah, for e.l.f. because they, they started off as a $1 makeup company. $1 for everything. So then I also got castor oil and some little mascara wands because I just posted on my Instagram story like what lash serums people use and every a lot of people said castor oil works so I'm going to try it out. And if it doesn't then I'll probably just have to splurge on some crazy ass lash What's a, serum. What is a serum? What? What's a lash serum? To make your lashes go longer and fuller. It's not real. It's a follicle and it grows as long as it can grow. And it falls out. I'm gonna try it anyways. And it falls out. Let's do this. So I got the lights all set up. I need to set that one up fully, but I just needed like some in that for now. So this is what it looks like with the new lighting. I'm super excited about it. I mean, it does take up a lot of space. So if you do want to buy these, just make sure you have the room to store it and just like have it out when you're filming um because i know in my dorm i do not have this much room but i am going to film a little tutorial so i will vlog later so i'm done with my video i did have one fail though the lumi cushions did not match my skin color and i swear i got the darkest color but it looked so ashy and white on my skin and i was like come on i really wanted it to work because that's what i was talking about like the easy application or a powder foundation and I wanted to try those out, and those aren't powder, but like they're easy applicators. But I had to go and use one of my liquid foundations for a drugstore, which I really didn't want to have to do, but you know, oh well, I wasn't gonna go to CVS again and like try to search for something else. Um, but I am gonna return all that because like they all failed. Like, guys, like, okay, look at this blush thing. I talked about it in the video, but I'm still really upset about it because I really wanted it to work out. Like, it's from e.l.f. So this is the packaging. It looks so pretty. There's like a pink one. There's like these orangey brown ones. Like I love those colors. Like this color, like this like, I don't know, reddish brownish kind of color. I love those colors and I really wanted it to work out. So this is what it looks like. I'm just gonna, cause I don't really have that many hands. I'm gonna put it there. And this is what came with like, it honestly doesn't look that different on camera, but in person, it's a big freaking difference. Like, these are not orange browns. These are all pinks. Like, pinks. I don't know what happened here, but Elf, you need to, like, fix this because I was really upset and it's definitely getting returned. But I did like the size of this compact and the mirror was really nice. Like, the mirror and, like, the feeling of this, it doesn't feel that cheap. It's just, I was really upset with colors, so. But I'm really excited because my lights actually looked really, really good. Like, even right now, it looks awesome. I wish they were kind of, like, a little bit warmer. They kind of look a little fluorescent. But obviously, I can go in and color grade it. I actually really wanted these because this year, I'm going to film my chapter sorority recruitment video. So I wanted these lights for, like, the interview parts. And I think it's going to make it look really good. So I'm pumped about that. So we came to Northway Mall with my sissy. We're gonna go to Sephora and get some samples. So we got good jeans samples because- From, is that the company? Oh, Sunday Riley. Oh yeah, it's from Sunday Riley. So this stuff is really expensive and I just want to try it because I have the Luna oil and I feel like it's doing its job, but right now it's in the like, causing all the issues to happen. Uh -oh. So I'm really sad, but I know it's gonna be Worth all it. for the best. And also, I have this weird like neck wrinkle and I feel like it's going away. What the so frick? That's... I have a neck wrinkle. Yeah, so I feel like it's going away with using Luna oil. Interesting. We also both got the Bosha um, charcoal mask. I don't know if I've talked about this on the vlog, but I 
just want one that actually works. I have one that I got from Amazon and it doesn't really work that well. So we'll try this one out. So I got the luminizing black charcoal mask. Can I tell them they don't yes, get no. the fastest way there? Yep. Yeah. We've been literally planning on seeing bad moms for so long now and we're finally doing it. It's been out since Thanksgiving. And we're finally doing it. And our next movie is Pitch Perfect. Take a selfie. Three. We're at the Cheesecake Factory. This is my favorite bread, the brown one. It's so freaking good. So I'm back at home. The movie was pretty good. Like I'm not a super harsh critic of movies, but I mean, it was funny. And I just came home to two packages, one from Target, one from Dose of Colors. I kind of splurged with Dose of Colors. I got like the new palettes that they had. And then from Target, I have another outerwear, like a jacket. And it was like half off. So I was like, okay, like I have to, like it's so cute. Hopefully it fits well. Quick sneak peek of what I got from Target. I was really not expecting this like at all like I thought it looked a lot more pink online but honestly like it's a really cute color and I really wanted to wear fur on New Year's Eve. I didn't know it was like actual a fur coat like it looked like furry if that makes sense but just like not like as bougie as this. I don't know I'm kind of like digging the color it's like a plum like mauve color. So these are the two palettes that I got from Dose of Colors. It's the Sassy Siennas and the Blushing Berries. I'm going to open them up really quick. I'm really liking that they're this small because whenever I travel or just like want to put my makeup in a bag, now I don't have to bring a whole palette. Guys, look how gorgeous these two palettes are. I love all the colors in these. I'm really excited to play with that berry color. Also, I swatched some colors just like lightly and they're like so pigmented. It wasn't even like a legit swatch, so. <laughs> Thank you. 